In the event of a power safety shutoff, communities can be left in the dark for days, even weeks. We know this full well, but PG&E is testing a battery backup system in Forest Hill so they don't have to be. Let's find out more about this. CBS 13 Sade Brown live in Auburn with neighbors' reaction to this new addition. Sade. Well, overall, the reaction is positive to this plan. Now, some say after the winter storm last year, what they experienced with downed trees and no power, this could be a relief. We had a power outage for over two weeks when the snow fell. For Sean Santos, that's a situation that he doesn't want repeated in his Forest Hill community. Weeks without power, eating cold canned food. Without power, I was just like, it was candles and eating out of a can. But that can change now with the help of a battery energy system, all powered by solar, put on by PG&E. So that during a, a broader grid um, event where there's a loss of power, we can keep this pocket of services available for the community. It essentially turns the general section of Forest Hill Road between Baltimore Mine Road and Racetrack Street into an island hub where people can go for services when they don't have power and wouldn't have to travel to another area. That means places like the gas station or bank, the post office, or the food market will still be up and running. And for the most part, this battery system could be a good thing. Awesome idea. I think it's really wise. And a lot of it last year was because of a lot of fallen trees. We had a lot of tree damage up there last year. And while others think it's a great idea, some are concerned it could be at a price. Hopefully they won't uh, throw an extra charge on top of our electric bill to pay for it, though. That's what I'm worried about. Now, we reached out to PG&E this evening to see if there would be an extra charge for customers, and they say there would be no extra charge would be the regular billing for them. Guys. That's good to hear. Sade, thank you. Live in Auburn tonight. Now to the